I'm Jason, and I'll show you a day in my life in the engineering development group at MathWorks in Natick, Massachusetts. I usually start by waking up at 6.15 a.m. After resisting the urge to smash the snooze button, I muster enough willpower to go through my morning routine of stretching, foam rolling, and making tea. At 7 a.m., I walk to the train station. Thankfully, it's a short walk, which is convenient during the hot summer and the cold winter days. Once we arrive, I like running before work, and the nearby rail trail is the perfect place for a morning job. I finish my run around 8.15 a.m. and head to the cafeteria to refuel after I shower and get dressed. Today, I'm having grapes, potatoes, bacon, and watermelon juice. At 9 a.m., I review a technical support case that came in last night. In EDG, you spend half of your time working on technical support cases and the other half on internal projects. For this technical support case, a customer asked us how to identify which points in a point cloud lie inside a CAD model he imported into MATLAB. This is a tricky problem, and I spend a lot of time brainstorming a solution. After an hour of brainstorming, I write some code, test it, and send it to the customer. The customer responds quickly and asks me to modify some parameters, so I edit the code accordingly and send it back. The customer is satisfied with my solution, so I close the case. At 12.30pm, we take a quick Mario Kart break before lunch. Today's lunch consists of chicken fajitas for me, and pasta, green beans, and a chicken cutlet for my friend. We were surprised with an ice cream truck on the lawn. This was the perfect way to cap off a tasty lunch. After lunch, I work on one of my internal projects. EDGers rotate through a series of mini-projects with teams they're interested in. For my current project, I'm working with the R&D team to write code which identifies and removes near-duplicate images from a large dataset. I'm testing my code on 12,000 images of gorillas. Hopefully, my code will reduce the size of the dataset to about 3,000 images, which will make the dataset more compact and easier to process. The code takes a long time to run, so I head to the break room with some friends to play ping pong. I wonder if ping pong skills translate well to pickleball, as I just started playing pickleball. After a few rousing games of ping pong, I grab a drink. We have free coffee, tea, coke, and water. My favorite is the peach-flavored water, but sometimes I'll get a hot chocolate during the winter. With my drink in hand, I head back to my office to check on my coke. It finished running, but the results aren't what I wanted, so I iterate until I get the desired results. Afterwards, I start the next part of the project, which is feeding the images into an AI model to classify the gorillas. At 5pm, I pack it up and call it a day. I'm on the MathWorks softball team and we have a game today versus another local company. We also have pickleball, basketball, soccer, running, and poker clubs too. It's 7pm and we just wrapped up our softball game. It was a close one, but we squeezed out the win. That's the end of my action-packed day. Thanks for coming along with me, and I hope to see you and MathWorks one day.